Hello everyone and welcome to this, another episode of Skyblock on the AZMC server. My name is Kasanis. In the last episode, we built ourselves that abode over there, the little tower in the front where I put my bedroom, all my stuff up top, and it's kind of decorated and everything's looking pretty darn good now. But, I say in the last episode, but you know what, that's, not, that's a lie. <laughs> I actually recorded another episode where I enchanted things like my bow, and I built that thing there that doesn't work anyway, and I enchanted all my sword and everything else. I did a whole bunch of good stuff, but I did it all with my mic turned off. Amazing and professional, aren't I? Yes, I am. You guys didn't miss a whole bunch, actually. Like I said, you missed a little bit of enchanting, and you missed me trying to build this thing over here. I can cut this down now, actually, because I'm not using it. It didn't work. What I was trying to do here, there's not really anywhere on the on this island where Endermen can uh, can form, can can spawn. There's not really anywhere that's that's lit appropriately and that's three high. So I'm having a real problem here. If I do slash C and we take a look at these, my slash. Let me just make sure my mic's on again. Yeah, my mic's on. Um, if I take a look at these and do slash C, we can see that we've got a bunch of uh, these to go. I've still got Pearl Collector, Baker, Explorer, and Expert Builder to go. Now, these are going to take a little bit of work before I can actually move on to the Master, and my idea was get some help with Pearl Collector, and I thought what I would do basically is I built, let me get out of here, basically what I did is I built a little pusher system up there, a couple of pistons. I wasted a ton of iron on pistons and on, let me show you what else, on, uh, don't jump over the edge, and on hoppers. I wasted a ton of stuff on there. Now, the problem I'm having is there's only five spaces. There's only five spaces for these things to spawn and nothing is spawning in there. Everything is spawning in here. There's no Enderman spawning in there at all. I'm having a problem right now. I went offline, or AFK, sorry, for about an hour and not one Enderman dropped into this pit. They really should be. They should be dropping in there. I thought they would be. Uh, and the entire time I was on, I only saw like one or two mobs actually fall into this area. And that kind of sucks. If I look in here, there's nothing in any of these chests. Nothing in any of these chests. So this was kind of a disaster. And thinking about it now, I, I kind of, I have another idea. I'm not going to work on this again uh, because, like I said, it didn't work out that great the first time. And I don't want to waste any more time. Let me just take this AFK stuff down because you ain't working anyway. Um, what I, I think I might have to do, and I think the big problem is, that's really... There's only five actual spawn locations in the piston dropping thing I, I built. Only five spawn locations. And that's not going to give a very high percentage for anything to spawn. Not when right next to it there's a whole bunch of uh, spawning locations. So I think what I'm going to have to do is figure out... Well, I'm going to have to figure out a way to turn this thing off. To turn off the spawning inside of my actual mob grinder. If I want there to be even a chance that that thing up there is going to work. So I'm not going to do that here because I wasted a lot of materials and I wasted a lot of time and everything else on that. And you know what? It's kind of disappointing anyway. So here's what we are going to do. I think what I might do offline completely, I might take this entire thing and put it on top, on the very top of my ugly mob spawner, put it way up high so I can stand on the mob spawner. And that'll put me close enough to this area that nothing will spawn inside of it, but far enough away from this area that things should form and fall all the way down and I can collect my goodies. That is my big plan. That is my big plan. I'm not going to do it now. I might not even do it later. Who knows? I don't know. I'm just going to leave it there. There's no point in taking it down. <laughs> it looks ugly as heck, but you know what? Ah, I'm not going to take it down. I did also use it by 90 levels. Like I said, I got this really poopy bow. It's a flame one bow. Yay for flame one. And let's go look at the other stuff I got. In fact, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna do an enchantment while we're up there because uh, because come on, you guys deserve to see it, right? And I got 30 more levels right here. Let's go up here and take a look. Uh, okay, these things here. What I got in here? Not in there. In here, I got myself a fire aspect two poopy sword and a efficiency four poopy diamond pickaxe. Not awesome, but that's the way it goes. Now we're gonna go up here, and we are gonna enchant a book. I've been keeping my book stuff in here. Boom, boom. Do I have any book stuff? Yeah, you go in here. Uh, we're going to enchant a book right now. Come on. We got ourselves 30 levels. 30 magical levels. And boom. Efficiency 3, knock back 2. So I can have a flame 2 knock. Or sorry, a flame uh, 1 knock back. Is it knock back? No, punches for bows. I can have a fire aspect to uh, knockback to uh, sword if I want to, or an efficiency three something crappy. 
I don't know what I'm going to do. But you know what we're going to do? We're going to leave these up here. We're going to leave our enchanted books up here, too. This is where we're going to keep all of our enchanted stuff right there. Bam! For later on. Maybe we'll even sell those off. Maybe we'll have a bookstore later. I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do. In this episode, guys, we are going to be solving... I don't know why this is happening now. Why are my chests staying open? Just close chests. Close. There. Um, in this episode, guys, we're going to do something. We're going to do a couple of these. Slash C. If we take a look at these again, Pro Collector is to collect uh, X number of Ender Eyes. I've got two, so we're not going to be doing that one anytime soon because my genius Enderman Cruncher didn't actually work. Uh, Baker is to build, uh, is to actually make cakes and pumpkin pies. Delicious, delicious. And I think we're going to tackle that one today because it's going to allow me to do a couple of things. We've got Explorer, and I think we might have everything we need to be able to do that anyway. I have to build a map. Let me see. Slash C Explorer. Explorer. Boom. Um, this one here requires that I build one map and I will lose everything. One map, one compass, one clock, 64 nether rack, 16 soul sand, and one gas tier. Got the gas tier, got the soul sand, got the nether rack. I don't have a clock or a compass or a map yet, so I'm going to actually have to build two compasses in order to do this, so that's kind of a waste of iron. Oh, I don't want to waste any more iron. So we're not going to be doing this one today either. We're going to have to collect some more iron first. And that's going to leave Expert Builder, which is have an island level of 250, and guess who what I'm at right now? Slash C. Uh, is land level... Uh, I'm currently at 140 crappy 5, so <laughs> we're not even close. I'm pretty sure it's slash C expert expert builder. I think it's 200 and something. 250. I, I have 100 more to go. I have 100 more to go. Really far off. Really, really far off. So, guys, we're not going to be doing that one either right now. We're not going to be an expert builder. That leaves us Baker. Baker is what we have left to do. And so that means I'm going to have to build a bakery. I need a medieval bakery. I need more things to cement in my medieval theme because that doesn't do it. That just cements in the ugly theme. Hello, ugly theme. But I think right in here, we could actually build ourselves a medieval bakery for delicious cakes and pumpkin pies. Mmm, delicious. I think I'm going to put it right in here. So what I'm going to do right now, guys, I am going to go about, collect some resources, cut down another one of these trees right here because... I hope this axe is going to last long enough. It may, it may not. These, these trees are so huge. Um, cutty, cutty, cut, cut. Um, we're going to cut these things down. We're going to actually build ourselves some more charcoal. And after that, guys, we are going to collect a bunch of resources and build ourselves a medieval bakery. And then we're going to bake some cakes and some pies, and they're going to be delicious. And I'm going to get another one of these challenges done. So for now, guys, I will talk to you all very soon. Okay, everyone. I think... I think this is exactly how I'm going to want it. Anyway, it's a basic layout anyway, and I, I think this is going to be reasonable as far as what I want. Um, the way I see it, I think that we're going to have a display case right along here. You know what? Let's pop it in. I'm not sure how long it's going to be yet. This is just a guess. But I think the display case can be made out of this really nice looking birch, just like that. It might be a little bit longer. I'm still not sure if that's in the right spot. And I think we're going to do the same thing on this side. So same thing over here display case on either side that way if people are out here fishing they're like you know what i ain't catching anything but mm, i could go for one of those cakes and this baker's gonna make some cash that's cool that's what he wants boom i don't know how long that's gonna be yet so we'll just leave it like that for the time being uh what i do want for certain i do want for certain i want let me get rid of this stuff here for now i do want uh a big I do want, let me see, is that going to work? One, two, yeah, that, that doesn't look so bad. I do want a big kind of oven back here. So there's going to be an oven back here. And oh, I have some of this. Let's put this down. Uh, the oven is going to be pretty simple. Boom, 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 boom. We're going to do this. Of course, this oven doesn't work. You know, I was told, do I have any? I do have one. Perfect. Uh, I was told in the original, originally in, uh, in Minecraft, you were able to throw stuff into the fire, and that's how you made obsidian and glass and everything else. Anyway, this is going to be our fireplace. Yeah, that's good. Uh, let's put some of these here. One, two, three. One, two, three. Not one there, I don't think. I don't think I want it there. Four. Boom. You're out. You're out. All right, like that. And I think what I'd like to do... 
Let's add these guys here. So we're going to have to put furnaces somewhere. Let's add them in here. That might look stupid, but I don't know. Maybe three of them. I was going to put the crafting bench in there, but maybe three. Anyway, we'll, we'll look and see if we like this. We'll look and see. So that gives me plenty of room to work right like that. I don't mind that at all. And one space on either side. So let's actually extend these guys here up now. Let's go up here. One, two, three, four. Just like that. Boom. Take some damage. Uh, on this side here, you know what we're going to do? We're going to actually fill this in. Do I have enough of this? No, I do not. Boom, boom, boom. Just like that. Uh, and you know what? Afterwards, maybe we'll decorate this differently on the outside. I'll have to see if it looks kind of poopy on the outside. I don't know. Maybe it does. Maybe it does. That's going to go like that. And this is not going to go there. Is this going to go here? I don't know. Let's take this out for now and see. This might be all counter space along here. Don't fall over the edge. I need you. All right, let's. That might be all counter space. So one, two, three, four, just like that. Bam. This could be all counter space along here. I think. I think that's a lot of counter space, though. That's a lot of cakes this guy's got to sell to the no one who lives here, because no one lives here except for me yet. We're gonna have to change that pretty darn soon. We're gonna have to seriously get ourselves a village going here to populate this area, because it's kind of lonely here. Alright, that might be way too much counter space. I think I might cut it off somewhere around here. But you know what? Let's wait and see. Let's wait and see. And then this guy here is going to go up another three. Another three. We're going to keep this thing really simple. What? Out of the way, tree. Boom, just like that. And this side here, same thing, I think. I think same thing. Just like that. Okay. Now, maybe we'll... Let's extend this one more. For now, we'll extend this one more. That is a lot of counter space. So maybe I'll surround this thing here. Let's see. Do I want to reduce this by one? What if I reduce this by one on each side? And I put... I put stone in there. I'm just thinking out loud here. Three spaces for cake? That seems like a lot of space for cake. To display my wares. Seems like a lot of space. Let's do it. Let's get rid of this one. Don't fall over the edge, because I need you. And we'll get rid of this one here, too. And I think we'll put uh, a surround of stone in here. Like this. And along the top... Along the top... Maybe this guy here doesn't have as much money. He's a baker. He runs a terribly unsuccessful business, because no one else lives here. So maybe he's not going to use stone all the way up. Maybe this guy's going to use this. He's going to have a wooden pillar across. Yes, like this. Boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Like that. All right, so this is where he's going to display wares. Hey, bad my stuff. Hey, fisherman, you look hungry. Take some cake. So I think that's going to work. Let's do the same thing along this side. I think. <laughs> I think this is going to be open because this is where the public comes in. Uh, cake here. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get rid of this guy for now because he's not going to stay there. I think we're going to actually put it over here in the corner. We're going to put it right in there. Right in there. Nine, bam. Because really, that's the in secret ingredients to cake. You don't actually have to cook anything. You just put it in there and it comes out. No one knows that. No one else who lives here knows that. All right. So I think it's going to go just like that. We're going to have to extend this thing up, and we're going to need ourselves... Uh, do I have any of these left? I have three. That could be good. I'll have to look and see. So the cakes are going to go along here. We're going to actually build this thing up. Let's actually put these things here in, because we definitely are going to need a door to get in. This is where the public gets in. The public's going to come in this door here. Boop. So that's going to be a doorway right there, and I think then, yep, that's lined up just the way I like it. This is going to go here. One more. And across, what? Across the top like this. Boom. Alright, that's going to go across there. We're going to extend across this way here, which means I need one here too. I think one, one, two, three, four. Perfect. Missed. And across here. Now this area here is going to lead to his house. So that is going to be nothing for now. Nothing. Uh, we're probably going to fill this entire thing in. Uh, oops, I got stuck on the chest. 
I don't know if we're going to fill this entire thing in. Maybe we'll actually put like a decorative wool or something on here. I don't know. For now, get off the chest. What's wrong with you, laggy? All right, for now, we're going to do that. We're going to do that. And I think the door's going to go right in there. We'll have to move that chest after, but the chest is kind of full right now. Oops. Okay, so that's going to go like that. I don't mind that at all. Let's put in some... Did I bring some? Did I bring some glowstone? I did, six glowstone. And I have nine of these left, too. You know what we're going to do? Here's what we're going to do right now. We're going to extend this out. More counter space. And as soon as you walk in, you're faced with this chest. Oh, I don't want to chop it down because I know I don't have enough space. You're going to be faced with right away... Like that. And this area here, I think, is going to be all filled in. No, maybe there's going to be a window here. Just a little window, just like that. And this right here is going to be a counter, getter, inner, outer. How do you build those? Like this? Yes, two of them, perfect. So that's going to go right here. Counter, getter, inner, outer. All right, perfect. So this is how you get into his shop, right there. This is looking pretty good. All right, let's take a look now. Uh, how much glowstone do I have? I have six glowstone. We're going to need some lighting. We're going to need a little bit of lighting. So we're going to need some lighting here and here. This is going to be overkill. That's going to be counter lighting because you got to make your product look nice. Your product's got to look nice. And maybe here and here. Yeah, that should work. Just like that. So for now, we're going to put in one, two, three, four. Look at that. That's going to show off the product real nice. Hey, buy some cake. Buy some cake. We'll have to do the same thing on this side. Uh, so probably one here. I only have two left. One here. No, so I don't like that. One here and one here. That's how we're going to do it. Because I only have two. I don't want to smash any of it. So we'll go here. Eight. Bam. Just like that. So some more counter lighting. Bam, bam. No one sees the counter lighting anyway. It's off to the side. No one sees it. Perfect. Okay, so cakes, cakes, cakes. Yes, this is how I want it. All right, guys. I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to I'm gonna have to extend this out. I need a couple of doors. Why am I looking in there? We need at least two doors. So do I have any wood left? I do. One, two. Two doors. So one door is going to go right here. That is going to be the customer's door, and one door is going to go here. I'm going to have to decide what his little tower is going to look like. It's going to go outside there, and I haven't really decided that yet. So for now, guys, what I think we're going to do, I think I'm going to go off for a minute. This is the basic outline of it. I just wanted you guys to see the basic outline. I think I'm going to throw in a big roof on top of this, and no one wants to watch me build another roof because it's not fun to see. It's just not fun to see. Let's get rid of these for now. Don't need these guys. So I'm going to build another roof on top of this thing here. It's going to be a shallow roof, not steep at all. And then I'm going to come back here and we're going to take a look at the finished product, I think. All right, guys, I will talk to you all very soon. Okay, everyone, this thing is all finished up. Let's go take a look at it. Let's go take a look at it. And then we're going to try and grab up our achievement. So this is the Medieval Bakery. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm saying it's done, but yeah, I'm thinking about it now and I don't think I did the back. I did not, so it's almost done. <laughs> I still got to come out here and finish up along there. Almost done. Anyway, guys, let's go take a look at it. This is the Medieval Bakery. The way I set it up, I've got myself uh, kind of an area here where the uh, the guy sells his cakes and an area here where the guy sells his cakes, and there's a, a spot inside here. Let's go take a look. Let me close these doors that you get the full effect. Uh, here's where you order your cakes. Let's go on inside. Uh, right here is where the dude is going to stand. He's got himself some cocoa beans because he doesn't just sell cakes. He sells cakes. He sells uh, pumpkin pies. He sells cookies. He sells pretty much anything that's delicious here on Minecraft. So that's it. He's got his cakes displayed here. A uh, little thing in the corner here because really and truly that's how you make a cake. Let's, let's go take a look over here and then we're going to actually make one more cake, one more pumpkin pie because I had never done a cake or a pumpkin pie before, and this was kind of my first time doing it, which is kind of awesome. Right here, boom, we've got ourselves all the stuff we need as far as, well, not all of it, I guess. We're going to upstairs and take a look. Uh, as far as baking is concerned, I need a little bit of this, a little bit of this, a little bit of this, boom. 
Uh, and let's go up here and take a look. Okay, so this up here is his second floor sales because, you know, there's going to be people here working in this area here. They're, they're going to want suites. So he can sell to the people working in this spot, people working over there. He sells to everybody. So he's got a second floor uh, store as well. And then right up here is his little bedroom. And you know what we're going to put? We're going to make a cake right now. We're going to make a cake and the last cake's going to go on that shelf. Actually, you know what we're going to do while we're up here? We're going to get some pumpkins so we can get some pumpkin pie. Boom! Let's go see how this thing's doing anyway. I haven't been here in a while. Ooh, a lot, actually. Let's grab up uh, these 44 for now. Let's grab up the pumpkin pie. Or the pumpkins to make pumpkin pie. All right, heading down into here. Okay, so the cake recipe is pretty darn easy. You require three things of milk, though. And that was, I went and bought some more uh, lava buckets, because I'm going to need lava anyway. So I bought three more lava buckets. Three more lava buckets go there. Weed across the bottom just like that. Sugar, sugar, and one egg in the middle. Boom, and that makes a cake for you, just like that. Pumpkin pie is just as easy. Pumpkin, sugar, w no, egg, Bam, and that's how you make a pumpkin pie. So we got both of those. Uh, I'm gonna put them. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take these out actually for now. I need this, 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 this. And we're gonna take one of our cakes and we're gonna put it up top because this guy here, he he lives and breathes pastries. This guy lives and breathes cakes. So we're gonna drop a cake right there. Five, boom, and that way when he's sleeping, he's sleeping at night. He's like, hmm. Mm, oh, I wake up and I can see my cake. That's the way this guy thinks. That's the way this guy thinks. All righty, all right. Now, guys, to end this episode, we are going to do one last thing. We are going to do our slash C baker. And it requires five cakes and five pumpkin pies. And I have exactly five cakes and five pumpkin pies. Well, actually, I have more than that. It's going to get us five gold ingots. Nice. One diamond, 100 rewards. Fifty dollars, and that's it. So slash C, C, C Baker, boom. There's my gold. My cakes are gone. Left me with a couple of pumpkin pies. That's good. I have something to sell still. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Actually, there's a lot of gold now. I can probably make two apples. So that's kind of cool. I hope you guys did enjoy that episode. I hope you really enjoyed it. I enjoyed bringing it to you. I hope you like our medieval bakery. Uh, he's got everything he needs here. Like I said, to 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 sell to the public so come on down guys buy yourself some cakes if you guys did enjoy it let me know with a thumbs up i'm gonna make another cake right now if i can i can't because i don't have any milk let me know with a thumbs up guys that would be awesome that tells me what you like and what you don't like on my channel he also grows his stuff out here and i'm gonna actually move a uh i think i can move a cow out back where you can kind of get to him oh i killed all my cows can these guys here be milked can i milk baby cows all right all right Where'd that dude come from? Where did that dude come from? Probably right here. Let's see. No, BL10. Where did that guy come from? That was a little freaky. Anyway, guys, I'm going to make one more cake here. Let's go back inside. I hope you did enjoy that episode. That thing didn't kill me, at least. No armor. It's obviously on... Uh, <laughs> It must be on easy because there's no reason why I would have survived that creeper exploding that close. Bang. Let's put this up there. I hope you guys did enjoy that episode. I enjoyed bringing it to you. And you can milk baby cows. If you did enjoy it, let me know with a thumbs up. If you didn't, a thumbs down is perfectly fine. There is no problem with that at all. That tells me what you like and what you don't like on my channel. And I really want to know what you like and what you don't like. That tells me a heck of a lot. So guys, thumbs up, thumbs down. I would love to see what you're doing with your island. That would be very very cool uh, show me what you're doing in the comments below post an image where I can see it and of course all my viewers will see it as well I want you guys to show off you guys are doing a great job out here I visited a lot of islands and I really really like them all so make sure you guys are posting down below post so that's thumbs up thumbs down comments down below and if you haven't done so please take a few seconds to subscribe have yourselves a wonderful night everyone